Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Stefan, and today I'm gonna to share with you how you can modify a massage gun into a pulse electromagnetic field therapy device. Now, I first got turned on to massage guns because I do a lot of strength training, yoga and stretching, and I have some spots that are a little tight, and these things are amazing for breaking up scar tissue and just for increasing your flexibility and for improving your posture, improving your performance at the gym. This is the R1 by Roll Recovery, and this is an excellent massage gun. Just in and of itself, it's already really great for the athlete and for the person that is looking to improve their posture and their overall health and wellness and remodel connective tissue and things of that nature. Now, the simple addition for this that makes it even more effective for those deep tissues that need healing or are struggling to heal or they they kind of have problems in terms of breaking down the scar tissue is that you can make it into a pulse electromagnetic field therapy device. And so I took the deep tissue attachment here. There's four different attachments. We have the, the flat head for the roll recovery R1. We have the, the prong. And then you have the, the ball, which is really great for just general work. But I took the deep pinpoint therapy head and I added a hemispherical magnet to the inside. So pulse electromagnetic fields are basically when you have a magnetic field that's pulsing like this. Now you can create a pulse magnetic field at the RPM of this device by adding a static magnet inside the attachment. Here's a clip showing how I inserted this hemispherical magnet into this attachment for the Roll Recovery R1, and I purchased this magnet from Lee Valley Hardware Store. They're based out of Canada, they ship to the US as well. And I just put some super glue in there and attached it. And so it has a little bit of weight now. And when you then turn this on, there's four different settings on this specific device. This is setting one, two, three, and then four it's now pulsing this magnet back and forth through space time as a result, creating this pulse magnetic field. Now, the reason why this is so useful uh, in terms of helping you to break down old scarred connective tissue is because it induces what's known as the Hall effect, which is when you have a pulsed uh, magnetic field, it creates electric currents that are perpendicular to that in the body. So the body has a whole bunch of different bioelectric currents through it. You have your nerves and you have your muscles and connective tissues that host uh, electric currents through them, bioelectric currents, and they run in a certain way. But you may have scar tissue or some uh, area that's dysfunctional that these currents are really flowing through and it's the electric currents of your body that inform uh, your cells, how to remodel, how to de-differentiate and then heal and to completely regenerate an area. So by inducing the Hall effect and by sending some portion of that bioelectric current perpendicular to the normal flow, it can reach into these areas that typically don't get that healing electric signal and then as a result trigger the cells to express themselves uh, epigenetically differently and to start that healing process. So let's say I have a, uh, I had a calf tear, I had some sort of issue on my calf, uh, some sort of tear, and I was having scar tissue problems there. With this pulse electromagnetic field therapy addition to this gun, I can simply massage my calf with this attachment, and maybe I use the stronger power setting. And by doing this, I'm inducing that uh, spreading of bioelectric current through the muscle. And that, in my experience, is uh, greatly beneficial in uh, inducing a healing effect, breaking up scar tissue, remodeling connective uh, tissue and fascia and uh, all those things. So this is just a little hack, a tip and a trick that I wanted to show you for turning a normal massage gun into something that has greater uh, usability overall because it already has four different attachments. So I only put the magnet inside one of the attachments. I don't want all of them to be pulse electromagnetic fields. 
you have to be mindful of your usage with pulse electromagnetic fields. Uh, you don't want to overdo it because there's a certain point where it's no longer beneficial. But if you just put it on the single attachment, for example, this deep tissue attachment where issues are uh, the hardest to address, um, then I think that's good and fine. And I especially like adding it to this deep tissue attachment because some of those uh, tissues that need healing and remodeling, for example, I have a uh, kind of a, a scar issue here with my deep hip from powerlifting. That magnetic field will pierce through those tissues. And so while I'm getting this vibratory effect from the massage gun, and it's physically breaking up things by inducing this vibratory resonance in those tissues, that magnetic field is also then piercing even deeper into those connective tissues and allowing for a breakup. So you can simply, let's say, stretch before or after your workout and then do this uh, massage gun therapy while you're stretching. And then the pulse electromagnetic field is a layer on top of that that makes it even more effective. So um, this R1 um, massage gun by Roll Recovery is awesome. It's about $120 and it is really, really great. I'm actually traveling with this. It's fairly lightweight and it's basically just as good as some of the more, much more expensive massage guns that I found. And a half, I think it's a half inch uh, hemispherical magnet fits perfectly inside the attachment there. Um, so one thing to be mindful of is that because this is creating a magnetic field that's pulsing rapidly, it may degrade the performance of this over time. So I suggest that you just use this with, um, you know, don't overuse this effect. But this is a, a way to incorporate a little bit more science and specifically like bioelectric science uh, and that's been linked with regeneration and healing into your fitness routine, into your uh, health and wellness routine that'll have an impact because this already is really, really great for uh, remodeling your connective tissue and increasing your posture to symmetry and all these great things. It can help you with your sports performance and workout performance. And then the PEMF is an additional layer on top of that's very useful. Now, one last thing I'll discuss is that they also have pulse electromagnetic field therapy mats. So you can have a more long-term pulse electromagnetic field exposure that can be useful for chronic disease, or uh, for other, like the entire body at once. And I think you have to be mindful of that too and not overexpose yourself to this because we're already receiving a lot of electro exposure from the man-made power grids and such. Um, but those can be useful under the right circumstances. And I would recommend the products from Miramate for that. They make a really good Schumann Resonance Pulse Electromagnetic Field Therapy Mat. Uh, called the Big Magic, so you can check that out. Link is in the video description. Link for the R1 Roll Recovery is also in the video description. And uh, yeah, wanted to show you with that, coming from a background of powerlifting, bodybuilding, yoga, calisthenics, and stretching, some gymnastics, I found this pulse electromagnetic field therapy addition to the massage gun, very, very useful, and you may enjoy that. And it's a fairly easy, do-it-yourself way to enjoy pulse electromagnetic field therapy without having to buy a $600 or $700 uh, mat, for example. So I wanted to share that with you. And if you liked the video, please click that like button, subscribe to see more content like this. I have a whole bunch of videos talking about electromagnetism and health. So I suggest you check those out and I'll see you all in the next one. Ciao.